Ah, oh, welcome back. So today I'm going to be fixing up my 44 for Steel Challenge and there's just a couple things I want to do. What I want to do tonight mainly arises out of a desire to not pay for more sites, for replacement sites. I know the Glock sites are not great. I personally don't like them either. But I have read there is something you can do that's cost effective that might be able to get you by until you want to purchase put the money down for good sites so let's get started today I've got my Glock 44 and I kinda wanna do a couple things to it I'm going to start using it for steel challenge rim fire because 9 millimeters getting fairly expensive and getting harder to source and of course everyone knows you don't want to use a all your stock of 9mm. So I'm going to start by making sure this guy's safe, which it is. Pull the trigger in a safe direction. And I'm going to remove the slide. Alright. So My idea here is I borrowed some nail polish from my daughter. It's just um, sinful colors, it says. Professional. This is the brightest stuff she had. And I don't really want to buy a set of new sights for this thing. So, as you know, the Glock comes with polymer sights. You got this weird little white U football gold post thing in the rear and then you've got just a plain white polymer piece in the front I don't know if you can see that, let me see it get the focus better so you end up with a very white sight picture which is not ideal, there's not a lot of contrast in that so what I'm gonna do, attempt to do is put a little bit of color on this front sight post on the cheap and I don't know if this is gonna work or not but I'm going to give it a shot I'm hoping that it's just gonna contrast over the white and not really do a whole lot to the black polymer part so I don't know so far so good I'm going to let this dry and I'll probably put, depending on how it, how it dries, I'm probably going to put another coat on it. Okay, and then for the rear sight, I've got the Sharpie here. And I'm just going to take the Sharpie, see if this can focus better. There we go. And I'm just going to fill in this white as best I can. To try to reduce the contrast. So I may put more than one coat of Sharpie marker on that too. But let's take a look at it now, see if it'll show up in the camera. I don't know if you can see that or not, it's hard to tell. But anyway, at this point, we've got a red dot and I've gotten rid of the white around so I've already got better contrast I don't know we'll see how it turns out I'll probably put a couple more coats on and I've got another part coming for this 44 that I'm gonna throw on that I think is gonna make the biggest difference for steel challenge and to make it a, a viable option for shooting Okay, so please like, share, comment, subscribe. That really helps me out. Uh, it really helps push me up in the algorithm. And subscribing and hitting the bell for notifications means that every time I put a new video out, 
uh, you get notified, you know that that's happening and you can watch. So I appreciate it. Thanks for joining me on the journey. LW Road out.